I think the pace of start is is starting to get it's starting to get to to something much more critical basically in this anime, which I was hoping which I was hoping for that it may go down on the road. And so we got introduced to basically some mysterious characters that we really do not know. We really do not know. But I would definitely would think I would definitely would think they probably do have some kind of relationship basis with Atari, basically with Atari. And basically what it means is that there's this guy basically who has a metal has a like a metal hand and, and stuff. And and I'm pretty pretty sure I'm pretty sure he's gonna become the villain basically in this anime, which I think he really actually is and stuff like that. And they said something there was a professor that may have that, that may have known something or anything like that. But the question is who's this professor person really actually is? Could there be a very good possibility that's prof- that the professor could become could become of somebody that Atari may 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 know. That could be a very good possibility. But what if, like I said before, back in my in, one, in my last episode review, I stated I said there's a very likely, very good, very good possibility that that the grandma. I don't think the grandma is not dead. I don't think she's not. I think that she's still around, and I think that she really actually is. And I feel like I feel like. I feel like that that's that that's to me and that that really tells me yes there's a likely very good possibility that she may not die or anything like that but if the if the question were to arise based of that but the question is how did she die or and or anything or anything like that that could be based on those very good possibilities which I still which I still say is my argument I still think that 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 the grandma is not dead and something seems kind of fishy about the story and stuff like that. But the, I think that we're about to get in, about to get one of our answers basically correct on basically like why she was in the capsule in basically in the first place, what she was doing in the capsule in the first place. What, why did he hide her, her hydro there in the middle of the sea to make sure to make sure to make sure maybe she wasn't close enough to be resurrected or anything like that, or maybe she's maybe she that she posed maybe a threat to maybe a possibility of humankind also as well too. Right, like that. I think there is a different side of Atari that we have not even seen. Or something like that. Yes, yeah, she's nice, she's pretty, she's cute, and stuff like that. And she does, she does, she does have an attitude problem and stuff like that. I basically, I definitely do. I definitely, basically, I definitely do understand those basic different, all those different things and stuff like that. But one thing I personally want to say here is basically is that, and I want to, I want to prove something. I want to prove something to people to, to basically, to really to understand. So let's say. This is your cell phone, or my cell phone, or anything like that. Okay, let's say, let's say you have all these apps and stuff like that that gives you everything what you need and stuff like that. Like when it comes to weather, your your money and stuff like that in your in your account, the news, your favorite sport, your favorite team, your your girlfriend, your boyfriend, your family, all that other stuff and stuff like that. But I've also ran into ran into a something that which is called an AI, which is called Gemini, Gemini Google. If you, if you guys have not seen it, I think it's interesting to check it out and. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to really go say really too much, but I'm just going to just show and I'm just going to tell you guys about what I basically what I think. And I want you guys to really think about this really hard about what I'm going to say right here and stuff like that. So, and it's going like that. So, basically, when I first got the Gemini Google, it says, it says, it says here, it says, Hi, I'm Gemini Google. Messages, chat with me, uh, draft messages, brainstorm ideas, plan events, or simply have, or simply have a fun conversation, which means that. Gemini wants to know, wants to know about me, wants to know about what's my interest, what, what are basically on some, some things. But if I were to give that information to to the AI, I feel like I feel like the AI will probably link my information to somebody that wants wants my money, maybe possibly even maybe more. And so I told Gemini, says like, how are you? And Gemini says, says I'm doing well. Thanks for asking. I'm always learning and improving, and I'm excited to see what kind of questions you. The questions you have you have today, which means that it implies it's basically like what I says, how are you? Gemini is there to answer my questions or anything like that. But you also gotta understand basically this is also a thing also as well I, I want people to really to understand also as well too. And I think this is very, very important that this is a critical thing I said and stuff like that. And I am not trying to be weird or anything like that, but this is something this is something that I ask Gemini is this can you be my friend? Can you be my friend? So Jimmy replies and says, "Why? Well, I can't. I can't be a friend in a traditional sense. I can be a helpful companion. I can engage similarly conversation, provide information, complete tasks as instructed. Let me know. Let me know how I can assist you. What means is that is that the AI, the AI cannot be my friend. Which means is that 
it cannot do that because it's not it's not part of the protocol based on what 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 my what, what the AI is supposed to really I should do. But like I said before, the AI is supposed to be supposed to there to help me and help me to understand other different things, help me of of different of different things that can really get what really can and stuff like that. And I find that I find I find that the, the Gemini is very is 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 very accurate. I would say not mostly accurate, but it it tends it tends to answer those questions. But I think the question. I think the point what I'm trying to say here is basically is that for people to really to understand to really to understand is that that basically trying to get the sense of the emotion from like Ari is basically is that is basically to, to me is that means that you won't be able to find out anything and, you know because like you're saying like oh yeah oh I love you or anything like that but even though she may not be able to understand it because she doesn't really understand what love really actually is she doesn't really understand. Even though, even though she said, like, would you, would you like me if I still had a heart? Even though the, the main real character said yes, but I think falling in love with a human, a human robot, it's not gonna really, it's not gonna really solve anything. It's really, it's not. It's, it's something that, I'm not saying it's a weird kind of thing or, or anything like that. Some people may think it really actually is, but I think that basically in the point I'm trying to make here is that I just don't think that that the anime should not go down this route. Because that's just basically what I definitely would think. Because like I said before, she she doesn't understand what love really actually is. Because she doesn't really understand. She may understand what you know, basically me and friends and stuff like that. But she may not be able to understand those kind of those kind of feelings. Because that's why that's why because she was made for a purpose and she was made for basically for those purposes and so and, and basically stuff. Even though I don't think Atari is basically is is dangerous or anything like that. I don't think she really actually is, but I think there's something something different. Basically, I'm beginning to sense that I think there's a, a basically a half her side of herself that I think there is a half her size of herself that's something that's something that we really do not even know, or maybe it was something, or maybe it was something we didn't really actually protect that if it was going to be the case. Yet, yeah, you know, not. And the point of what I'm trying to say here is basically that. Is is basically that if you were to tell a robot like how how you how you feel about where you love them or anything like that, would they be able to understand? No, because they because they won't. They they won't be able to understand. They won't be able to know. You know of, of those of those different uh different uh of those different scenarios that's going on, and you know and basically stuff. So I mean that that's basically what I I generally think, and I I really do hope that people definitely would basically would understand. And I definitely would think that people would basically not just to see, but just to, not just to see my own point of view, but the way I to, the way I look at to look at basically that way. But it's just something, it's just something that, that it's impossible for anything basically anything out there. Basically, just like I said, basically what basically what I proved here it says, "Can you be my friend?" The Gemini, the Gemini Google told me says, "No, it can't be my friend because you know why? Because because it can't." Because they can't they understand me, can't understand me about way the way I feel or, or anything like that. If Gemini were to were to say like, yeah, I I, I want to be a friend, but that would be impossible. But that would be very very impossible. Even though even though based with Atari, based on the other hand, she's based she can be friends with other different people. But the, the but the thing is that she does not understand to those emotions. She may not be able to understand those emotions. She would just find it that it was find it kind of like. It's impossible for her to basically understand. Like I point to my phone with the app, I will say it again. It would be impossible for for AI or something like that. You have something working for you or anything like that may not be able to understand. May not be able to understand any of those those kind of different scenarios and stuff like that. Because it's because if they were built to program to do things to post to help to assist, that's what their purpose is basically there for. They may not have a purpose basically. In real life or anything like that, they may not have that purposes or anything like that because they won't because they won't be able to to know what those things really actually are. So yeah, anyways, um, I hope I I'm hope I'm, I'm saying this right and stuff like that. I, I like it so I'm not trying to mirror this video. Basically, what I'm saying, basically with the with with my AI just to put it on my phone, but I'm just basically just trying to to prove something to to tell you people is that like as for it's just I think like as for it's still it's very impossible for. And hard to understand what love really actually is because I just think I just think she she doesn't really doesn't know she really doesn't or anything like that or maybe there's maybe something that she probably would understand but she really won't so yeah so yeah anyway so that's it uh, for, for for this episode rant um, rant, uh, rant so anyways the sunrise and I'll see you guys later take care hope to have a wonderful day 
Uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe. Please consider subscribing. Uh, please hit the like button. Give me a thumbs up. And please hit the notification bell as well too. Uh, yeah, and please hit the notification as well too. And so yeah, and this is Dynamics, and I'll see you guys later. Take care. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care. God bless. I love you guys. Please stay safe. Hey, remember, stay blessed. Love you guys. Take care. Bye.